How Chefin. My name is Chef Fran, and today we're continuing with our breakfast series. Hello, my chef and family. I am so excited to share some great news with you guys. And the news is, oh, I can't even contain myself, I'm so excited. I am a first time author. I have my new book out called, A Twist on Boring Salads, A Salad a Day. So now you guys can have a healthy, nutritious salad that's a little jazzed up, be the star of the party by bringing one of these salads to an event. And if you're on that healthy journey and that healthy kick, why continue with the same boring garden salad, right? Your cucumbers, your tomatoes, your lettuce, sometimes a little shredded carrot. And if you wanna spark it up a little bit, then you might have Caesar salad. But you could go way beyond that now with, look at all of these gorgeous salads, 30 salads for 30 days a week, 30 days a month. Sorry, I'm so excited I said a week. Hmm. a month. I want to show you a little bit inside to so get a little sneak peek here. Nice kind of, you know, big writing. Look at all the stuff. Just to kind of get, look at this. All of these salads are in full color. No black and white pictures. So you can see the full on version of what you're going to be making. Nice big prints. Take a look, take a look. Look at that. So I would love if you guys can support um, getting this book because this book is not just for you and being the star of the party, the star of the event and keeping healthy. It also helps support a great charity, um, a family suffering from food insecurity. So you can get yourself a copy of Amazon Dow. Um, who doesn't love Amazon? So go to Amazon.com and you can put Chef Fran. If you can't remember the name of the book, I'll come up. Or you could put a twist on boring salads. Go and self, get yourself a copy. Love you guys. Bye. And we have a parfait we're going to make here. Berry parfait. We have strawberry yogurt or granola, and we have some mixed berries in our glass. And then here we're going to make a smoothie. We have some almond milk, some ice, some frozen fruit, frozen berries, and some blueberry yogurt. Mm. Simple, quick breakfast that's super nutritious and cute at the same time. So let's get into our vitamin content. A Greek strawberry yogurt parfait. Our yogurt has vitamins B12, calcium, phosphorus, and riboflavin. Strawberry, vitamin C, K, magnesium, blueberries, vitamins A, C, K, fiber, manganese, and potassium, raspberries, vitamins A, B6, calcium, potassium, riboflavin, thiamine, and zinc, blackberries, vitamin C, K, manganese, and it's high in fiber and it may boost your brain health. Granola, vitamins B, D, folate, and zinc. That is for our Greek yogurt, strawberry parfait. And then we have our, blue, our berry smoothie, which has almond milk, strawberries, blueberries, blackberries, raspberries, and yogurt, blueberry yogurt. So, our almond milk has vitamins A, D, E, calcium, strawberries, vitamin C, K, magnesium, blackberries, vitamin C, K, manganese, it's high in fiber, it may, be, and it may also boost your brain health, blueberries, vitamins A, C, K, fiber, manganese, and potassium, raspberries, vitamins A, B6, calcium, potassium, riboflavin, thiamine, and zinc, and yogurt, vitamins B, B12, calcium, phosphorus, and riboflavin.
Real facts. It's estimated that over 3.5 million Floridians will be food insecure over the next five years. Food insecurity is a sad reality many face. To learn more, you can go to jdhcdc.org. So I am pouring our yogurt. We have our almond milk with a little bit of ice in here. And now I'm pouring our yogurt in here. You need about three to four ounces of Greek yogurt. You can have flavored Greek yogurt or plain. I have a little flavored here. I have blueberries. Now I'm gonna pour my frozen fruit in here. I'll put it in my bullet. Take all the juices from in here. Now that our smoothie's done, put the bird down here. So we got a little messy here. Nothing's perfect. Boy, I must be reminiscing Ian. Must be thinking about my buddy, my pal. I'm making a mess. Put your fruit. Baby fruit right here. Blueberries. So you can have a healthy, easy breakfast by making a breakfast, a breakfast smoothie with some almond milk, coconut milk, whatever your favorite milk is, oat milk, and adding some Greek yogurt to it, some ice. Or if you don't want to have ice, you also have frozen berries. You know, make the ice or have both frozen berries and the ice. Um, and this is a mixed berry smoothie. Or you can have, take a few minutes to put together a parfait with some Greek yogurt. Um, this is strawberry Greek yogurt with granola and some fruit. Some frozen fruit that I just let throw out so it has less sugar in it. This has no additional sugar, but the natural sugar from the fruit itself. And that's it. And you just layer the Greek yogurt between the granola. Well, let's um, begin to taste our smoothie. Mm -hmm. 
that's good. It's not superly overly thick, like some smoothies are, and you can't even drink through the straw. Um, it's perfect in regards to not being excessively sweet, since it is the frozen fruit. Um, it has just the natural sugars of the fruit itself. The Greek yogurt, as we know, Greek yogurt has less sugar than standard yogurt. Um, so it makes it taste a little bit more creamier. And the almond milk is unsweetened almond milk. So this cuts back on the sugar. So you just have the sugar from the natural fruits here. So it tastes really good. Nice uh, breakfast here. Or you can have your parfait with your spoon here. Let's dig in. Mm. The canola gives it that crunchiness against the smooth yogurt. And the fruit has spread out, so it's softer. But again, just its natural sugar. Not overly sweet at all. Mm -hmm. Really good, the oats, the granola, the nuts, has pumpkin seeds. Super good for you. Have yourself a nice looking, pretty breakfast. It's about the same amount of time as you bulleting or blending your smoothie. Really good. You can use this as a substitute dessert for yourself. Besides breakfast, a midday snack, as well as a smoothie. You can actually put some protein powder in your smoothie and make it a meal replacement like dinner if you don't want to eat late or lunch if you don't have any time blend it all together with a little protein powder these are two easy breakfasts that you can make you will enjoy them both and they take very little time and they're very much cost effective so let me know if you decide to make a parfait or a smoothie or both. Let me know what fruits you use, if you use any yogurt, and what yogurt did you use? Was it Greek? Was it flavored? Was it not? What fruits did you use? Maybe you didn't use berry, you used something else. So here's our call to action. Don't forget to click the like button by giving us a virtual hug. When you do that, you let myself and my crew know that you're enjoying what we're putting out for you. And it encourages us to keep going. And if you're new to this channel, welcome. We welcome you here with open arms and big hugs. And subscribe if, you're not, if you haven't subscribed already. And then also share this channel with your family and friends. Remember, sharing is caring. We thank you so much for hanging out with us today. We really do appreciate it. I came to you from another country to shoot this, to share my love with you of food and nutrition and the value that food has in, that goes in our body and things that are cost effective and just doing a quick breakfast series for you. And I hope you tuned in by sharing your love back to me. Thank you again for hanging out with me today. I really appreciate it. I hope that you come back to visit us again by watching our next episode. We look forward to hanging out with you again. Thank you. Thank you. We love you. Bye. And don't forget, go out and get your book. Be the one that stands out in your clique because you've got the Ma Chef book first. You have a twist on boring salads, a salad a day book first. Remember, this is not only gonna bless you and your 
you know, your family and the events that you go because of all these beautiful created salads that you make, it's also gonna help support the charity Joseph Dreamhouse, which helps families suffer from food insecurity. So go to amazon.com. If you don't remember the name of the book, just put Chef Fran, Chef Fran Glover, or a salad a day. It should come up that way too. And better yet, just click our link below and you can get this book. It'll be worth two causes, supporting the charity as well as blessing you and your household. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today. I really do appreciate it. Love you guys. Bye.